The government has set aside 3.7 billion shillings to curb the doping menace that is on the rise in the country following recent sanctions of Kenyan athletes by the Athletics Integrity Unit, AIU. Speaking at the Eliud Kipchoge complex in Kapsabet, Sports Cabinet Secretary Ababu Namamba issued a stern warning to the managers stationed in various training camps, saying they risk having their camps closed if they're found culpable in any doping case. Meanwhile, the Anti-Doping Agency of Kenya has vowed to work closely with sports stakeholders to ensure the country overcomes the doping menace. All the rules being given, even through you all. We are starting to get their information. Which camp are they from? Uh, who are their coaches? Who are their agents? Who are their managers? What time do they train? So that we can then now be able to raid in on those camps because maybe it is something that athletes of a particular camp are used to doing. We want an all-government approach and we want an all-stakeholder approach. We want Sazilu to ban athletes. Waine. Can you also show us that you have banned the, 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 the responsible uh, coaches? We must go for those agents. We must go for those coaches. We must go into those training camps. And if you are running a camp that has been turned into the classical space for doping, we are coming for you.